So in this video, we're going to show you how to use AI, artificial intelligence, to solve a physics problem using the seven steps. And let's find out if AI actually knows how to do this. And we're going to use uh, Gemini for this. And the first thing I'm going to ask is, what are the seven steps? And let's just see what answer it gives us. And for me in my class, step one is what is given. Um, so read carefully, visualize, draw a diagram. That's step two. Identify the unknowns there, step one. So they've uh, put step one and two together. Make sure you understand the, the problem. The formula is step three. And then don't rush to calculate, um, solve for the unknown. Re you might have to rearrange the equation, it says. So that's step four. So step four right here. Um, substitute and calculate. That is step five. Double check your answer. Does it make sense? So if you're asking for distance, make sure your answer is the final answer is in meters. Guidance, so it's, there's no checking for significant figures here. It's not asking you to double check your work. Um, maybe step seven here is sort of saying it. So let's, uh, let's go and see if it understands my or, yeah, my seven steps that I'm asking you to do. So this, uh, do you understand the following steps for solving math type problems? in high school physics. So write down what is given, draw a simple picture. Step three, what is the main equation? Isolate the variable, substitute from your given box into your equation, find the answer in proper sig figs, and do a unit check. So let's, and so what we're asking the AI, do you understand these steps? So let's just see if it understands. So it says it understands, absolutely. So it's actually giving some advice before step two, add something, read problem carefully. Um, so it, it understands it, if it actually can solve a problem. So I think this question, so it's, I'm asking it to use the above seven steps to solve this problem, label each step. So I think this is from learning guide one. A car accelerates uniformly from rest uh, for 6.5 seconds. And, it, and this time, the car's displacement is 30 meters. And calculate the car's acceleration. So let's just, we're going to use to see if it can solve it using the seven steps. So I'll just scroll down. Let's just, okay. So let's just see. So step one, what is given? The AI can't draw anything, but it's asking us to draw a picture. Here's the equation. When you're showing your work, make sure you don't use these symbols. The little star, the, um, the up. I'm not even too sure what uh, chevron or whatever that's called. I'm not too sure. Do not use that for superscripts. Isolate the variable. So we're looking for acceleration. So it's, it's isolating the A here, acceleration, but it's not showing us how to isolate. So step four, they've done it, but you need to show the steps on how you isolated it. Now we're going to substitute the numbers into the given equation. Um, they put in the numbers. However, they did not put in the units. The units are missing. So you need to do that. Um, Find the proper, so there it is. There's the answer, 1.42. And they, they got the approximate sign there because if you plug this into your calculator, the number is actually much longer. The square root, so it has three sig figs, so it's putting in the three sig figs. Unit work out meters per second squared, which is a correct, so it's not actually, you got to redo this step with the unit check. Um, 
to make sure you got meters per second squared. So it's actually not too bad, but it's missing a few steps. Let's just see. Share export. What else we got here? Let's just see what happens when we put longer. Let's just see if it puts in the units for step five. Oh, look at this. They, uh, they put the square root in, but here they're missing the units. Uh, they're missing the units. But the final answer, they're giving the proper units. Well, okay. Make sure to include the units when showing the work. So let's just see if that works for step five. Did I do that wrong? Let me just copy that all over. Let's just start a new. Okay, so this is looking better. Oh, oh no. Sort of tried to draw a picture. Oh, they got the units here. Well, of course, you're not going to have the units in uh, steps three and four. But here they put in the units. Perfect. So that's a little bit better. So you need to play around with the instructions. Oh, I'm not sure draft. Sorry, just... Um, make sure to include the units when shot. So we've added that little part. So, so what you're going to have to do is play around with this. Uh, maybe try a new chat, play around with the prompts, and see what kind of answers you're getting from the AI. You need to be very, very specific with the prompts so it gives you the best response. Contact me if you have any questions or concerns.